Hey everybody, so today I'm going to be doing a Michaels haul. It is pretty small, but um, I got a bunch of things that I will probably be reviewing. And yeah, let's just get started. So the first thing I got was this um, pearlescent watercolor pan set by Artists Loft. Um, I got this because I really want to do some watercolor uh, projects in the future and I also got a Jane Davenport journal recently so I want to do some watercolor stuff in that and I didn't have any watercolors so I got these they were five dollars and it comes with 28 colors and I really uh, like these colors. Sorry for the glarage. The next thing I got was this um, uh, Artist Loft watercolor pan set. It says 36 pieces, so I assume that means there's 35 colors because they probably include the paintbrush. There's the list of all the colors. So you can pause the video and read that if you want to. Um, here's the list of colors for the pearlescent one as well. Also sorry if the video kind of zooms in and out a lot. I have an autofocusing camera so it does weird things. And also sorry for the glare. I just have a really bright light on so that I have a good light for my video. Um, the next thing I got were uh, these Recollections water brush, water brushes. Um, I got these to use with my watercolors because I know that these work really well with watercolors and I wasn't sure what kind of brushes to buy and I already had a bunch of brushes at home. So I decided to get this because I've always wanted to try them ever since I saw them in like the Jane Davenport videos and everything. Um, the Jane Davenport ones, I believe, are a little more expensive than this. This was uh, $7.99, so I don't know why it says $9.99 on there. And it comes with the two different tips on it. Um, so, yeah, I will be doing a review video on these as well. Um, also, both of the Artist Loft watercolor sets were $5 each, if I forgot to mention that. The next thing I got were these um, uh, precision tip pens. Um, they are 0 or 01, 03, and 05 are the sizes on them. Yeah, I just got these for journaling and such in my Jane Davenport journal. And they are the Bible journaling kind. Uh, these were $2.49. So I figured that was a really good price. And I wanted more pens in case I broke my fine liner. Because I'm clumsy and the fine liners are very fine, obviously. So they could get damaged easily. The next thing I got was this sticker pack. Um, it is by Recollections. I believe this was $1.99, but I'm not sure. It comes with 221 pieces. Let's see if my camera will focus. Yeah, and they are um, puffy stickers, so but they're not super puffy. Um, and I got these to put in my journal. Again, just, I got everything for my journal, basically. And then the last thing I got, my, basically, definitely my favorite thing, was this uh, Recollections Pineapple Puffy Stickers, 15 pieces. Um, it was $1.99 for this pack. I really like these, and they are a bit puffy. I don't know if you can tell there, but yeah, they are a bit puffy, so I will just have a very puffy journal. My journal won't close flat, but 
I don't really care because I just, I needed these pineapple stickers. I've just been so obsessed with pineapple stickers lately. So I, as soon as I had money and I knew I was going to Michael's, I was like, I need pineapple stickers. I'm not leaving that store without pineapple stickers. So I got some pineapple stickers. Overall, I think I paid about 16-ish dollars for this entire haul because I had um, some coupons and everything. And yeah, um, make sure to stay tuned to my channel for reviews of these products. And make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye!